Hey y'all, welcome back to the party. It is me, your girl, Brit Reacts, and today, today we are reacting to the king of the PDC, Chris Stapleton himself. I asked you guys to leave me comments and let me know what I missed during my maternity leave, and an overwhelming amount of you let me know that Chris Stapleton was dropping some bombs while I was gone, and... Well, duh, we're going to listen to them together. I'm so excited. If you don't know what the PDC is, well, that means you're really new here. And we welcome all newcomers. The PDC is the Panty Dropping Club, and Chris Stapleton is the OG of that club. He is the OG of making the ladies drop their draws, <laughs> okay? And so we love him. We love him here, and I'm really excited. So with that being said, let's see what he has to say. All right. You can feel this in your soul. You can feel this in your soul. I could climb the highest hill. Reach my hands up to the sky. Chris with the falsetto to the sky. Ooh. I know I didn't know I needed from Mr. Stapleton. Um, yeah, the I love how how much time they took to to come into this song. I love that we got to really kind of marinate in the dun -dun, dun -dun, dun -dun, dun -dun -dun of it all. You know, you kind of like you you're percolating, you're stewing. The pot is boiling, it's simmering. It allowed us to simmer. And then he kind of comes in with this very mountaineer type of vocal. Did I just make that up? <laughs> you damn right I did. Duh. Uh, but that's what it feels. Like. It feels very earthy. It feels very like hearty. It feels, I mean, it's it's all things, Chris. Um, but that falsetto. Da, da, da. Stank on ya. Hold on. I think I got to go back a little further. I can fly <laughs> the hill. Reach my hands up to the sky. Sky. Maybe touch a passing cloud. Maybe touch a passing cloud. My heart would know all the while. Come on, Chris. That should take me high. I have tears in my eyes. That was my chair, by the way, creaking. I have tears in my eyes. Wait a minute. <laughs> Just the, huh? the, 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 the full on like suspension of the, the, the pull, the draw. Oh, it's giving vulnerability. It is, I think for me, I, I, I haven't, I haven't listened to his entire catalog, obviously, but I've listened to a lot of his music here on this channel. I don't think I've heard this side of him. It feels so like refreshing because a lot of times I think ooh, his music can feel heavier um, just because of the type of vocal that he has. This feels so light and airy and and simple and and, you know, it does feel like you're reaching up and you can touch a cloud. It feels that way. Oh, man. Oh, man. The power in that, right? The like, oh, it just got so big, but not really like it was like big, but uh, I can't explain it. I can't explain it, but I'm really happy to be here. Christopher Stapleton. I didn't 
know his voice could do this. I'm freaking out. I'm, free I'm wigging out, guys. I have tears in my eyes. Concealer catcher. The, uh, I don't, is, is the, that we just heard, is that a guitar or is it that like steel guitar thing? Either way, it felt like a slow draw on a cigarette. Like, you know what I mean? And I don't smoke. I don't, I don't smoke anything. My lungs, my brain, I, I don't smoke, but it, I can tell you that it felt like a long draw on a cigarette. Like it just felt like it filled the air it was really nice i love the space that this song is in it's in a, a different this song. and i don't know why it's making me emotional anyone else anyone else feel a little i, I need to call my therapist my <laughs> that Woo. and look down across the land it could never Come on, Chris. Makes you want to sit up. You gotta, you gotta fix your posture when he does that. Like you, like pull me up higher, Chris. <laughs> Y'all, I don't know why this song's making me emotional. I don't, I don't know why. Um, you know, maybe it's the postpartum chemical imbalances, but. I feel emotional. So much hurt Chris who hurt him who hurt him who hurt him because he's singing like his heart is broken like he's been through something like like there's there's been a tragedy a trauma a, a, an event he's singing from hurt it feels like I don't know I, the man probably is living his best life but he just can tap in to a emotional place you know he feels like such a calm gentle relaxed spirit but like when he opens his mouth where he can go where he can tap into it feels like he he has gone through a million different things you know and I don't know he could and he could not have he could have lived the best life and it's just a part of his talent but his ability to evoke emotion for me at least taps into my like vulnerabilities and my my things that I deal with on a day-to-day -day basis. And that I think speaks to his, his talent, his ability to connect, you know? Um, <clears throat> it's so funny. I, the nail salon I go to, the, the, the uh, receptionist is a young like high school girl, I think, or maybe early college. And she controls the ox at the nail salon, if you know what I mean? Like she controls the music and she always... Chris Stapleton is always in the mix, like always. And it always throws people off because I'm always, if it's a song I know, I'll start singing it. And I, like, I feel like people look at me like, what is this little black girl doing knowing about Chris Stapleton? Let me tell you something. He, he understands me and I understand him. And it doesn't matter what I look like. There's something in his music, in his voice that resonates with me. And we have got to stop putting labels on people and what people should be listening to and what people should sound like and what people should like and, and, and enjoy because of what you think they look like. And for me, Chris Stapleton resonates. I think I think anyone who has the opportunity, a lot of times just it's just a lack of exposure. Like I didn't know who Chris Stapleton was before I started this channel. Um, I was never exposed to him. It's just a lack of exposure. And I didn't know to go out and look for him. Um, but, you know, people from all walks of life can hear his music and resonate with it there's there's that that's his gift um 
Yeah. I'm sorry. This song is incredible. It's incredible. Uh, 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 uh. I can shoot out. I can speak. I could shoot out. <laughs> so good. Count the end of sea of stars. I love this melody. Oh. What will you I'd have to say? My heavens never quite that far. Could you take me high? But for you, I'd have to say my heaven's not that far because you take me higher. Is that what he just said? Bars. Poetry. Poet. This is so poetic. Like, those are wedding vows, okay? Chris, you better. So much <laughs> the fact that we, you know, didn't get that. Well, we did. There were parts where we got the raspy, smoky bluesy vocal but that falsetto that soprano what a surprise what a delight what a delicious delectable thing that was I, I, we gotta keep going we gotta listen to the whole project i don't know what else to say this is and when he starts dropping the visuals or the live performances someone check on me send a welfare check i might pass out do you hear me <laughs> I can't. I can't even say this is the reason why he's the king of the panty dropping club because this right here was like spiritual, it was on another level. But I wouldn't be surprised if some panties was dropping. And that's with all due respect to his wife. All due respect to you, ma'am. We love you because you also can sing your hind parts off. All right. Um, well, my concealer catcher needs to be cleaned, so I'm gonna go do that, and I'm gonna ask you to go and have the day that you deserve. Peace.